Hello guys, welcome to the series of tutorials on scientific programming with MATLAB. Today we are going to see how to control a DC motor using MATLAB. So this is the circuit diagram for uh, connecting motors. Here I am using Arduino Uno and a driver IC of DRV8835 manufactured by Texas Instruments and the inputs of this motor driver are d10 d9 d8 d7 and d10 is for uh, speed of the motor one to control the speed of the motor one and d9 is for to control the speed of motor two d8 is for to change the direction of the motor one d7 is for changing the direction of motor two so now let's code this so this is the code to control the DC motors so here initially I have uh, initialized the Arduino you know and then configuring the pins we are uh, configuring the digital pin 10 9 8 in output mode and then here comes our main logic so while PWM a uh, while PWM duty cycle here the most important thing is we can control the speed of DC motor by using the PWM signal duty cycle if the duty cycle is one it means we are going to uh, send the full voltage if the duty cycle is 0 0.5 we will send the half of the voltage uh, and if the duty cycle is zero it means there is no power uh, no voltage transferring so when we are when we are providing 5 volts the motor will run very faster when we are providing 0 2.5 volts the motor will run uh, in a medium speed when we are going to give 0 the motor will not run so this is how we are going to control the DC motor by using uh, PWM signal duty cycle here have uh, given 0 0.75 to uh, a speed of the motor and digital write pin 8 in 0 here 0 means the motor will run in forward direction 1 means motor will run in backward direction and similarly I have uh, given duty cycle of 0 0.75 for the motor 2 and the direction direction f uh, 0 means forward direction for the motor one now let's execute this so guys uh, let me add one more point for this tutorials I'm going to use Juma board produced by uh, polo loop robot and electronics and uh, this is a good uh, robot integrated with a lot of sensors and motor DC motors and so on so this is the Zumo board here we can find two motors here on the right and on the left motor one and motor two and the Arduino Uno is connected on is sitting on the top of the Pololo shield this is the Pololo shield and uh, this is also equipped with a uh, array of sensors IR sensors yeah then now go to the program now run the program whenever you are uh, executing a, a new program dot m file you need to add uh, to the path now it is running so now we can see the execution part see this is how the motor is running in the both directions in the both motors Thanks for your attention.